Absolutely concerns indeed. Now this patch program is made possible through a partnership with people here at Beaumont, but also with a healthcare system network out of Ohio. That healthcare network out of Ohio is pulling the plug, leaving families with a lot of unanswered questions. She has a genetic disorder and that causes multiple um, medical special needs. The Pirtle family is one of 28 families depending on the patch program for their daughter, Luciana. When they found out Alternative Solutions Health Network out of Ohio was dropping out of the program, they started to worry. I reached out to our team first, our nurse and all that, and they basically said, we, we know nothing. We, I don't have anything to tell you. We don't know what is going to happen. The patch program helps Luciana get treatment and therapy from home and provides equipment that would otherwise cost thousands of dollars. It also provides a social worker to help with insurance claims. This family, along with others, now fear what will happen if the program ends. We would be lost. We would go back to rushing to the ER for every little thing. We spent less than one day in the hospital really because of the patch program. We've got nurses coming to check on him and they, they really know him. Seven Action News reached out to Beaumont Health. They released the following statement. We are committed to our patients and families and the patch program is not being shut down. We are also working with others to address the statewide need for these kinds of services. Seven Action News also reached out to Alternative Solutions Health Network. They are currently not providing any further details at this time. You're afraid that this Thing you rely upon so much that believe me everybody is really thankful for um, is going to go away. I mean you can hear the concern in his voice. Ali we know Beaumont is saying the program's not shutting down. Any idea what will happen next? Well that's really the unanswered question here. What is going to be happening next? And as soon as we learn what's happening next we'll update people on air and online at WXYZ.com.